That's the Bolt Badge. Four. Four badges. Halfway through, baby. Oh, God. Please don't kill me. We just lost our starter. Oh, I missed. Come on, survive! Ah! Oh, of course I got the freaking crit. I hate rotation battles. Do I like apple juice? I don't really like any fruit juice. Like, I would, it's just like, like they say alcohol is empty calories, but at least that gets me like, feel in a certain kind of way, you know what I mean? Uh, I feel like juice is just like soda, but like without the bubbles. It's more natural, so that's probably like better, but like, it's still a lot of sugar. I'm not, I'm not a big fan of juice, is my point. Is I guess what I'm trying to say. You should try pickle juice. Pickle... Are you... Hitting on me? <laughs> are you... What are you... Hmm... What... What is pickle juice there, Mr. McDillionaire Gaming? What... What is it? What is it? The juice is 1.3% bugs and mice. Sure. I mean, if that's what it is, then it is delicious bugs and mice, so there's that. All right. Driftville Drawbridge. Man, screw that rotation battle. That's got me in, like, a bad mood now. On the, on the plus side, we get a guaranteed ducklet here, and then we also... <gasps> we finally get the chance to hack in some items. Oh, there it is. Here's our encounter. Level 26 ducklet. All right. Come on, ducky. One, a two, a three. Got her. All right, Pickle, you had the perfect name. What brand does this ducklet remind you of? And we are going with Aflac. A-F-L-A-C. A-F-L-A-C. Good lollipop reference. Lollipop reference. Oh. Yes. <laughs> Thank you. That's literally every, what I think of every time I count. do that count, by the way, is like I think of that. I'm going to... Let's see. Uh, let's check out the duck. Check out our new duck, or Aflac. Brave. Plus attack. Minus speed. Don't love that, um, but it's pretty much attacker or a special attacker and protects the Pokemon from lowering, getting its defense lowered, which is, I don't think that's the better one. I don't think that's the better one. What's the other one? Keen Eye, or it's Accuracy. So I guess, I mean, it's fine either way. We're going. All right, are we ready for the drop? Are ready for the drop? Yes! Let's go! What a banger! Two towns in a row. The Nimbasa City Gym and the Driftville City theme. Mm, absolutely on the playlist, you know what I mean? For sure! Drunk. Oh. Oh, I wasn't paying attention. Let's have fun stealing Pokemon together like we did before. I've learned the hard way that stealing from others is wrong. Is there two branches of Team Plasma? Don't they call you a villain who's plotting world domination? Even though you quit Team Plasma, people are still really cold to you, right? Interesting. So let's see, here we can get a Deerling or a Shelmet. A Deerling or a Shelmet, a Meryl or a Carablast. We can get a guaranteed Shelmet if we try and go 20, well actually no, because we could get a Fungus too. Um, 
In the double grass, though, similar situation. Ooh, there's a hidden grotto here where we can get a fungus. <gasps> I think we go for the hidden fungus, don't we? We could also go for a nose pass. Does nose pass evolve? Oh, Wallace and Gromit. Oh, good reference, Grush. I haven't thought about Wallace and Gromit in a really long time. Uh, what's Woobat's thing? Simple. The effectiveness of all stat modifications is doubled. That's just on him, right? No, I think that's on everybody. Ooh, spooky, spooky. Um, yeah, Fungus gets Regenerator, so that is amazing. And honestly, the Nose Pass isn't half bad either. So, like, I think we try and go for the Hidden Grotto. What is it? What are we, a Route 6? Wait, it says it's just Fungus or Regenerator. Fungus or... Fungus or... Oh, wait. Why is there two Route 6s? Oh... Because the other one has the nose pass. Well, I guess I don't really care about nose pass. I'd rather have the fungus. Yeah, we need an am Amoongus with generator. It would be so good. Like, actually unreal. So I think we just try for that. We want an Amoong Amoongus. Let's see. Might just be an item. Blue shard. Can we just we can just reset it, right? How do we reset it? I think it's like a hundred steps. Yeah, it's one hundred steps. I think that's how it works. Let me look it up quick. Uh, hidden grottos are very small areas around the Unova region. These are small area gaps between trees. Can be active. They seem. Uh, numerous features give out blah blah blah. Typically, when you go into an area once you have mined it for its interactable Pokemon or items, the hidden grotto is different. The contents of hidden grottos change and can get regenerated repeatedly. Whenever I take 256 steps in game, there's a 5% chance that each of the hidden grottos will be regenerated. Okay. So, this might take a hot minute, is what I'm understanding it to be. <laughs> It's on to the next one. Sorry, my bad. I should have a warning. Is there a dowsing machine? It's possible there's nothing in here. Yeah, I don't think this is going to just reset. So we're going to bag. We're going to wait on this thing because I don't think I need it right now. I think we can afford to wait until... Wait, didn't I already face this lady? Okay. Can you just face the breeders in unlimited amount of times? Because that's kind of annoying. The nice thing is, is I'm in the rain. I think I'm just going to bubble beam. I don't think this is going to kill, but it should do a lot of damage. Wow, almost killed. And then we're going to switch because the deerling is a thing. Actually, I guess it's grass type, so we could probably just kill it with... Kill it with air slash. Oh my gosh, it's out speeds. Okay. Okay, well, this should die. That other breeder did fight me three times. I think the breeders can just, like, face you as many times as you want, or as, as possible, which is, like, kind of weird. I wonder if it's just, like, a reset when I leave the area and come back. Um, which means, I think we just go try to take on the gym right away then, yeah? Leftovers, Amulet Coin, Eevee Light, Leftovers. Because he is so defensive, and we're about to face two physical dudes, so, you know, we'll be smart about it. And they're both male as well, so it's male, 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 male. 
Only female is Trubbish, who isn't coming in on the Swoobat anyway. Okay, we heal, we face the guy. And then I'm probably done for the day, so I can go to the bar. <laughs> Okay, so there's the sage. So you're interested in t Ra Rud? Ra Rud? Is that his name? If you hear what we have to say, you might be able to understand us. My guest. If you're going to come inside, I would like to see what kind of person you are, trainer. That's right. Yes, I do. This guy's only got 27s, right? Yeah. Yeah! Well, so I'm meeting my uh, mother and father-in-law for dinner. And so, with my wife. My wife and I are meeting them for dinner. So, like, it'll probably be like 5, 5.15. We'll probably do a little bit of prep for the gym, but that'll probably be it for the day. So we get an Intimidate down. He gets an Intimidate down. Everybody's happy. And then we probably switch. Are you able to meet me at Jimmy John's? <laughs> no. <laughs> um, Axeman is gonna get trashed. We're gonna party. The place that I'm going to, you can buy like a stainless steel uh, 16 ounce mug and it's got their like logo and stuff on it. And you can bring it back and every time you get a drink there, you get $2 off the drink. And so like the beers are then $5. Also, if there's ever a happy hour, so like the beers are already $5, it's still $2 off. And so you get a beer, like a good craft beer for like three bucks. Pretty sweet. Pretty sweet. Pretty, pretty sweet if you ask me. Okay, we're gonna switch to, um... Uh, so we lowered its attack. I think we just try switching to Q-Tip, because he's not gonna come in on the other one, and if we do okay, then we get a char- I think this has charm, right? Summary? Yeah, it's got charm and cotton spore. So we try and come in. We charm if we can. If not, Okay, that's fine. Perfect. So now its attack is back to normal. And so we charm. Charm. It's now attack has lowered two stages. And so we're going to charm one more time. Sorry, now it's negative one. So then we get it to negative three. If I remember the correctly, the AI really doesn't like if it has a workup move. It really doesn't like being negative. So it's going to be at negative three right now. So now it's at negative two. We're going to use Cotton Spore once, and then we're going to use Charm again. Because that'll just guarantee that like we can move faster than it later, which will be super helpful. So now it's at negative one. Now it is at negative three. Now it's at negative two, and now we leech seed and then charm again. Now it's at negative one. Or sorry, now it's at negative two. And now it is back at negative three. Or it will be at back at negative three. Oh, sorry. Now it uses takedown. Nice. Okay, we should be pretty okay. After this charm, we should be able to Giga Drain. And then just kind of try and stall it out. Man, that is a lot of health from Leech Seed. I did not think it would be that much. This was ended up being a way better strat than I thought it would, by the way. So how much do I heal from each of these? Not all the way, but pretty... Oh, wow. So after I Giga Drain, I should kill it. Q 
Q-tip is... Cottony is so good. It is seriously so good. If this thing has Prankster, it's borderline broken, by the way. If this thing has Infiltrator, RIP me, but normally it would have Infiltrator. Um, okay, so Swoobat uses Air Cutter. Yeah, that's a crit to kill. Um, so I definitely switching. I have to sleep. You're all, you're good, Grush. I, hey, thanks for being here. Like the video before you head out. I always appreciate you being here. You have a good night's sleep. Feel free to, you know, watch it tomorrow. It's available. So it will be available. It'll be cut up later. You do you, my friend. Thanks for being here. Have a good weekend. Stay safe. All that good stuff. All that good stuff. Um, it's going to use a flying move. Because I, I, I have my... Oh! Well, you could... Well. Eh. It's in the subscription thing. But ha have a good one, Grush. It's all good. Bye-bye! Have a good weekend. Watching Fish with Guns Season 2, Episode 14. What does Fish with Guns? What is that even? I don't even know what that is. That sounds crazy. Um... Ooh, you know what I think we do? I think we switch to Hefty, because it's going to want to use a flying move. Then we switch to Croc, because it's going to want to use a psychic move. And then I think we switch to... Because uh, that gets an Intimidate down, and then we switch back into Mount Hardware. Let's do some of those strats. Because it's going to want to use Air Slash, right? Or Air Cutter? Um, Heart Stamp. Yes, it's for sure going to want to use Air Cutter. Where is my... I lost my thing. Okay. So yeah, we switch to Hefty. Nice. Should tank this pretty good. Nice crit. It's gonna wanna use Heart Stamp now. And then we switch to Crocs. It could also use Attract. Either way, we get an Intimidate down and we nullify the move. There you go. And then it wants to use a flying move because it can't use the other move. So we switched to Mount Hardware, which tanks it because we're a rock. Let's go. Shout out to that Eevee light. Smack down. Okay, I won't use any of the four moves that you have, which is fine. Nice. And then we one more time for the kill. Easy, baby. With the sweet pivots. With the sweet pivots. Hefty, hefty, hefty. Wimpy, wimpy, wimpy. No Evos. Team Plasma made trainers like him suffer. I feel terrible about it. How foolish we were. As you can see, I can't do anything to thank you. Actually, I have a favor to ask you. Could you please look after this Zora? What? Huh? What? Hold on. I have to see if I actually want this. I didn't realize that this would be our encounter here. Um. Okay, so I don't think there's any encounters in Black and White 2 that I can get here. That's not the Zora. The Zo Zora? Zora? So I think we just get the Zora. Zorua. Zorua. Let me see the map. I just want to make sure. There's not access to water anymore. So this is our this is our encounter here. Yes. Okay, well, I gotta go get my box. And then we gotta name the Zora. I'm gonna look it up in just a minute here. I'm gonna try and check for anything else in the Hidden Grotto, and then we're gonna come back, and then we're gonna go back to the Hidden Grotto. And that's what we're gonna do. Okay, so you can just walk around her. I'm gonna register the dowsing machine. What is Y? Okay, there's nothing in here. So every 256 steps... Did I run out of repels? 
Every 256 steps. I did. Um, that can reset. And so my assumption here is that when I go take all of these steps to get to where the places that I need to go, um, it, ge it gives me an opportunity to like reset that area. So we always want to check. Hey, Zorua. Zorua. Welcome to the squad. All right, we need to give him a name. Where's the name raider? We have to give him a name before. Name raider black two. In Castelia City, in the leftmost building. Okay. The metal office in black and white two. All right, before we can check it, we have to go all the way back to Castelia. Okay, so it's in the metal office. I think the metal office is in the base over here. Yeah, this guy. I want to name it. No! Why can't I change? Can I not change the name of this? Can I not change the name of a gift Pokemon? Can I not do that? I can't, I can't name it. I don't think, I think that means I can't use it, right? Let's see what it is first. Hasty. Plus speed, minus defense, okay. It comes disguised as the Pokemon in the back, which is pretty good. So like, also it's special. I didn't realize this thing had really good special attack. Okay. N owns it, oh. So what are the what are the rules for Pokemon? I guess I would assume that I'm probably just good to use it, but like, I don't know. I might have to look that up. I might try to actively avoid using it until I find out otherwise. But I'm trying to think of. I mean, I'm not going to use it. It's not like I'm going to use it for the next gym, so I have time to figure this out. Nah, I don't, I don't think... I feel like breeding in Nuzlocke is kind of like... Cheating out. A little bit. Well, actually, no. I can't do that. Because I can't... It's dupe, Dupe's Claws. So I, I can't do that anyway. So there you go. That answers that question. 